welcome back you guys Ow. today i will be showing you guys how to juice no i'm kidding of course i am back with another behind the scenes of a setup you guys will see shortly how i accomplish that i will be using the window as well as a artificial light source so stay tuned let's get started today i will be using my handy dandy canon 60 and then i had the choice of picking either my 50 or my 85 the 85 is way too tight for the shot that I'm trying to accomplish. So, the 50 millimeter it is. Here I am removing the back of the lens cap and the camera body cap. This will allow me to attach the lens to the camera so I can take the picture. Say cheese. For today, I am using my Westcott strobe. I am actually going to fix this light right next to the window to add more light. Um, today is a very overcast day, so there's not as much light pushing through the window. In order for me to accomplish that, since it's not very sunny out today with light coming in the window, I'm gonna add artificial lighting. In my West Coast strobe it is. So in order for you to be able to take the picture and for the light to flash and sync with it, you have to use a transmitter and a receiver. The transmitter connects to your camera and the receiver connects to your light. And then it's time for what? What's that? Huh? The design. Whoa, where we going, where we going, y'all? Where we going, where we going? <laughs> Stay tuned, we're almost done, guys. I have a few prospects. I have juice supplied by my beautiful cousin, Tika. Shout out to you, girl. And then I am going to be using a beach hat. Yes, the tag is still on there. In case I don't like it, I'm gonna turn it. What y'all think? It's kind of cute, right? And then, of course, I have my letter board that you guys will unscramble. Time to get set up. I am setting up my focus, and then I am going to use my remote trigger to be able to take each image. Thank you guys for watching. This has been another behind the scenes video. What do I always say? See you guys next time. Peace.